I've been given some DS lights and the the two I've got here don't turn on so I thought well I'll just open them up on screen so the blue one this must be a damaged screen here and here so I think that's just going to be two two damaged screens on that one but that doesn't do anything if I plug the charger in the orange light comes on and then goes off but the battery compartment it's definitely had some battery leakage this one I'm about to open the black one with the battery installed the orange light will stay on oh that looks quite nice some water damage I think the first thing I'm going to do put a little bit of alcohol in that switch that doesn't seem to be the switch so I'm going to test for voltage at the switch where's my multimeter gone 3.9 volts at the switch I'm just going to see if I can check for continuity yeah the beep and I'm quite happy that the switch is working I do have a couple of screens which are broken but I know they'll come on so this top screen I could connect this top screen back up I'll plug the top screen in like that the bottom screen's still in and we're still not getting anything so do I replace the bottom screen now what's going to happen is I'm going to forget which screen's which put the known working screen in I feel like I'm clutching at straws with this one nothing there must be a problem with the board I think so obviously it's had water damage I don't know what that is that must be a capacitor the only corrosion I can see a problem with the board was around this component and it says capacitor 99 so I'm just looking at this capacitor which has got continuity on it I wouldn't expect a capacitor to have continuity on it that's all I wonder if I can test that capacitor on this blue one so I'm going to take that off I'm going to take that off there and I'm going to swap it over I'm going to take this one off grab me tweezers I've pinged it I don't believe it I've pinged it is that it? is that it? found it yeah. oh, I've pinged it again there it is this capacitor is a nightmare I'm going to swap them over and see if that makes any difference and if it doesn't make a difference I'll be calling in a night Right, let's see if we can get that plugged in there. I've lost this capacitor about three times. I've managed to find it every time. I'm sure enough, my luck's going to run out soon. There you go, that's gone. And I shouldn't have continuity. No continuity. What does that tell you? Working top screen. It's booting up. It's working. I fixed the bloody thing. So a quick recap. The only fault I had with the board was some corrosion on capacitor 99. I've swapped capacitor 99 with a, a spare board and now we have we have power that's fixed I just need to put it back together I can try the original screens which do look in good condition so thank you very much for watching this was donated to the channel by Paul RB King I'd like to thank RB King for giving us something get me mind into and I will see you in the next one thanks for watching